Okay, so we're going to prove that A complement complement is in fact equal to A for any set A. So let's go ahead and start this proof. So all this is doing is this is using um, the definition of the complement of a set twice, right? So we'll have um, X is an element of A complement complement. So by definition, this means that X is not an element of A complement, right? That means that um, if X is an A complement complement, that means X is not an element of A complement, right? But if X is not an element of A complement, then this must mean that X must be an element of A, right? Because uh, remember, if we have a little picture here, right? So this is the universal set and we can have A here, right? So if X is not in um, A complement, so remember this is A, so everything outside, right? Everything outside is A complement, right? So this is A complement. Everything outside of A in the universal set is A complement. So if X is not in A complement, that means X must be in A, right? Because that's the only other place X could be in the entire universal set. So that means if X is not an A complement, X must be an A. So we have that, uh, so we have that for every X, right? X is in A complement, complement if and only if X is an element of A, right? So that means, so since we have this statement, that means that A complement complement must be equal to A, and that is the proof.